Yo, what's up, everybody? Hope you're having a great day. Uh, today we're playing some Mass Effect. I've never played any of these games before, despite having them for years. Uh, I got, like, old copies, like, disc copies or whatever, but the, uh, um, what is it called? The Legendary Edition? I just downloaded it for fun. I figured I might make a YouTube video out of it, so let's get into it. You can't give Buddy long hair? What the fuck is that? Y'all see my hair, right? I can't make him have long hair? You only got short hair? I mean, I guess this came out in 07. Is this all white people hair? Like, are there no afros? I guess I get a, you know, I get a low cut fade. Is that it? Like, all right, then we're gonna go with this right here. I didn't really feel I changed your name, so he's gonna stay as John Shepard, um, spacer, soul survivor, and a vanguard because he got a shotgun. Seemed like he'd be doing damage, so we gonna go with that. Identification confirmed. Oh, uh, I've never played this game before, so I'm gonna do veteran. Oh, all right, finally starting. Damn. Well. What about Shepard? He's a spacer, lived aboard starships most of his life. Military service runs in the family. Both his parents were in the Navy. He saw his whole unit. Hey, is that buddy from um, he could have Rick and Morty? The black guy? Scars. The president? Every soldier has scars. Shepard's a survivor. Oh, that's him. Yeah, that's his voice. Is that the kind of person we want protecting the galaxy? That's the only kind of person who can protect the, the black I'm gonna show it on the screen, like right here. Right, you watch Rick and Morty. It's him and uh, the, the giraffe motherfucker. A year 2148. Explorers on Mars discover remains of a civilization in decades. Mysterious artifacts reveal startling new technologies. Travel far, blah blah blah. Technology controlled space and time. Oh, what do they call? Oh, they call it Mass Effect or some shit. I was lying, actually. I was joking. Thought it was gonna be something cooler. Are we on Jupiter? Oh, no, we're not. The Arcturus Prime relays in range. Initiating transmission sequence. Commander. Is this supposed to be Uranus? We are anyway. connected. Calculating That's an ugly looking man we just passed. The relay is hot. Acquiring approach vector. This shit look kinda cool though. The All fuck? stations secure for transit. Hey, watch out, big dog. Is that a robot? Forward is green. Approach run has got me right there. That's a John. Hitting the relay in three, two, one. What did the relay mean? Oh shit. Oh, was that like check navigation? Hitting Check. uh internal emission sinking gate. What's this shit called in Star Wars? All systems I don't fucking forgot. Drift. Just under fifteen hundred. Where they go fast. I don't forget, bro. Fifteen hundred is good. Oh Jesus. Will be pleased. Okay. His shit look kinda cool I hate though. That guy. Damn, okay. My bad. Nihilus gave you a compliment. So you hate him. Facts. What's up with him, bro? You remember to zip up your jumpsuit on the way out of the bathroom? That's good. I just jumped us halfway across the galaxy and hit a target the size of a pinhead. So that's incredible. It is incredible. Besides, specters are trouble. I don't like having them on board. Call me paranoid. You're paranoid. I think he's racist. He definitely a racist. They have a right to and I'm send standing right to behind keep him. Your investment. I should have made myself yeah, white. That is the official story. But only an idiot believes the official story. Wait, what the fuck's going on? What do I agree with? You're overreacting. You always expect the worst. Oh god. Now, bad feelings are an occupational hazard. But we don't go anywhere unless there's a good reason, so... What are we doing here? Joker! Status report. Just cleared the mass relay, Captain. Stealth system's engaged. Everything looks solid. Good. Find a comm buoy and link us into the network. Not a comm buoy. I want mission reports relayed back to Alliance Brass before we meet Chief Prime. I can literally I, only I, hear... The Better president of Rick and Morty's sir. voice. I think Nihilus is headed your way. He's already here, Lieutenant. Tell Commander Shepard to meet me in the calm room for a debriefing. All right. You get that, Commander? <laughs> yeah, 
Yeah, I think I got it. Is he upset? You made him mad. I heard. Um, I think you made him mad, bro. Great. You pissed the captain off, and now I'm going to pay for it. <laughs> Don't blame me. The captain's always in a bad mood. Only when he's talking to you, Joker. For real, though. I don't know if I mess with Joker like that. Press pause to access the mission computer. Oh, okay. I can bring out my gun. Can I shoot anybody? Oh! Can I shoot someone? If I shoot someone and like it works or whatever, I'm gonna have to start over. Oh, it doesn't work. Okay, never mind. Is that a grenade? Can I pick it back up? I lost health? Can I start over? Alright. Alright, let's not do that again. How do I put my gun up? Damn it. Why did I bring it out again? Who's this? Oh, Presley? What's good, bro? Congratulations, Commander. Looks like we had a smooth run. You heading down to see the captain? I heard you arguing. Sounds like you don't trust our Turian guest. Sorry, Commander. Just having a chat with Adams down at Engineering. I didn't mean to cause any trouble. But Bet you have be. to admit, something's odd about this mission. The whole crew feels it. What do you mean by that? You think the Alliance Brass is holding out on us? If all we're supposed to do is test out the stealth system, why is Captain Anderson in charge? And then there's Nihilus. Spectres are elite operatives, top covert agents. Why send a Spectre, a Turian Spectre, on a shakedown run? It doesn't add up. Mm, you investigated that. Oh, oh, um. You don't trust Nihilus. I don't like Turians in general. It runs in my family. Oh, okay. My so the red first face dude is war, a Turian. Lost okay. a lot of friends when the Turians hit us. Plus, he's a Spectre. Nihilus is no ordinary Turian. You've got that right, Commander. We're an Alliance vessel, human military, but Nihilus doesn't answer to the captain like the rest of us. Spectres operate outside the normal chain of command. And they don't come along just to observe shakedown runs. <laughs> Nihilus looks like he's expecting some heavy action. I don't like it. Mm-hmm. You being real sus of him right now. Do you have a problem with the captain? No, sir. But I can't figure out what he's doing here. Captain Anderson is one of the Does most decorated special forces officers in the service. If he melted down all his medals, he could make a life-size statue of himself. You don't send a soldier like that on a do-nothing mission. He's treating this shakedown run too seriously. Something big is going on. You think so? I'll look into it, bro. I'll no see if I can it. get some answers when I see him. Good luck, Commander. Why do you say that shit so loud? Captain's in charge here. He wouldn't take orders from a Spectre. Not his choice, Doc. Spectres don't answer to anyone. They can do whatever they want. Kill anyone who gets in their way. Oh, you watch that... too many Spy Kids, Jenkins. Yeah, you seem like you watch a lot of Spy Kids, honestly. What do you Damn. think, Commander? We oh. won't be staying on Eden Prime too long, will we? I'm itching for some real act. I sincerely hope you're kidding, Corporal. Your real action usually ends with me patching up crew members in the infirmary. Her voice sounds familiar, too. Um... The doctor's right. Only a fool goes looking for a fight, Corporal. Sorry, Commander, but this waiting's killing me. I've never been on a mission like this before, not one with a Spectre on board. He, he's given, he's got like death written all over him. I feel like he gonna die. Um, they talking about Eden Prime. Prime, aren't you, Jenkins? What's it like? It's very peaceful, Commander. They've been real careful with development, so you don't have any city noise or pollution. My parents lived on the outskirts of the colony. At night, I used to climb this big hill and stare across the fields back at the lights from the main settlement. It was gorgeous. But mm -hmm. when I got older, I realized it was a little too calm and quiet for me. That's why I joined the Alliance. Even paradise mm -hmm. gets boring after a while. Okay. Where are we going there? Any idea why Eden Prime was chosen as our destination? Not really sure, Commander. Eden Prime's one of our most stable colonies. Good place to take the Normandy for a shakedown run, I guess. No real danger there. There's got to be something else going on. We've got a Spectre on board. That's why I'm so wound up. I can't wait for the real mission to start. Damn. Why is he so, he's so, like, energized for this shit? You know what I'm saying? Like, is he good? 
Man, you the beauty Just this like every other assignment you've had, and everything will work out. Easy for you to say. You proved yourself on a coos. Everybody knows what you can do. This is my the big chance. I need to show the brass what I can do. Hey, man, there's no rush, bro. You're young, Corporal. You have a long career ahead of you. Don't do something stupid to mess it up. Don't worry, sir. Just not get shot. I'm not gonna screw this up. I hope not. The right, captain's waiting later. for me. Goodbye, Commander. Hey, what's up, big dog? Where's the, Commander where's the Shepard, captain at? I was hoping you'd get here first. It will give us a chance to talk. Talk? What about? I'm interested in this world we're going to. Eden Prime. I've heard it's quite beautiful. Uh... Beyond beautiful. They say it's a paradise. Yes, a paradise. Serene, tranquil, safe. Eden Prime has become something of a symbol for your people, hasn't it? Proof Her voice that humanity can like not only establish colonies crazy. across the galaxy, but the also fuck? protect them. You get that but like how safe is it really? Oh, you so you doubt and shit. Yeah, you know, what's your what's your point? If you've got something to say, just say it. Your people are still newcomers, Shepard. The galaxy can be a very dangerous place. Is the Alliance truly ready for this? I don't really know. I think it's about time we told the commander oh, what's going on. And he's black here. Okay. This mission is so far just more the same person. simple shakedown run. What's going on here? Is someone gonna fill me in, Captain? Yeah, what's going We're on? We're making bro? a covert pickup on Eden Prime. That's why we needed the stealth systems operational. Why the secrecy? There must be a reason you didn't tell me about this, sir. This comes down from the top, Commander. Information strictly on a need to know basis. A research okay. team on Eden Prime. Unearthed some kind of beacon during an excavation. It was Prothean. Fuck is a Prothean? You wanna let me know about I that? I thought the Protheans vanished fifty thousand years ago. Oh, okay. Their I guess legacy you still knew. remains. The mass relays, the citadel, our ship drives. It's all based on Prothean technology. This is Big Shepherd. The last time humanity made a discovery like this, it jumped our technology forward two hundred years. But Eden Prime doesn't have the facilities to handle something like this. We need to bring the beacon back to the Citadel for proper study. Mm -hmm. Obviously, this goes beyond mere human interests, Commander. This discovery could affect every species in Council space. Um... You sound worried. Are we expecting trouble? I'm always expecting trouble. Okay, that really There's answer more, my question. Nihilus isn't just here for the beacon. He's also here to evaluate. The fuck is he here to evaluate me for, bro? Ain't that the commander? Hold on. Why? What's going on, Captain? The Alliance has been pushing for this for a long time. Humanity wants a larger role in shaping interstellar policy. We want more say with the Citadel Council. The Spectres represent the Council's power and authority. If they accept a human into their ranks, it shows how far the Alliance has come. Not mm -hmm. many could have survived what you went through on Akuz. You showed a remarkable will to live. A particularly useful talent. That's why I put your name forward as a candidate for the Spectres. Oh, is the Kuz? Because I set my um my thing up as a sole survivor. Is that what they're talking about? Is the Kuz the place I was a survivor of? Um, he support this only. I assume this is good for the Alliance. Earth needs this, Shepard. We're counting on you. I need to see your skills for myself, Commander. Eden Prime will be the first of several missions together. You'll be in charge of the yeah, ground. That's me. Secure the beacon and get it onto the ship ASAP. Nihilus will accompany you to observe the mission. Let me investigate a little bit, though. Let me talk about this. Let me talk about um the beacon. Why is this beacon so important? All advanced galactic civilization is based on Prothean technology. Even yours. If we hadn't discovered those Prothean ruins buried on Mars, we'd still be stuck on Earth. That was just a small data cache. Who knows what we can learn from this beacon? What if it's a weapons archive? We can't let it fall into the wrong hands. What wrong hands? Like who? The Attican Traverse isn't the most stable sector of Citadel space. Mm -hmm. There are plenty of raiders and criminal groups active in the region. Mm -hmm. They might figure a Prothean beacon is worth the risk of attacking an Alliant ship. You think Plus so? Eden Prime is right on the border of the Terminus systems. What's the Terminus system? The Attican Traverse is under Citadel protection. If the Terminus systems attack, it's an act of war. Technically, yes. But some of the species in the Terminus might be willing to start a war over this. 
The last thing the Council wants is to get dragged into a major conflict with the Terminus systems. We have to keep this low-key. They said low-key back then? Um, I'm going to be honest with y'all. I don't really... I understand, like, maybe half what's going on. So just give maybe the word, they'll just... Captain. You know what I'm saying? Let's go out close there. To Eden. Captain, we got a problem. Oh. All right. What's wrong, Joker? Transmission from Eden Prime, sir. You better see this. Bring it up on screen. What, they getting shot right now? Get down! That's a fire suit. The the white suit shit look kind of fire. What the fuck is happening now? Boy, they getting fucked up. We are under attack, taking heavy casualties. I repeat, heavy casualties. We can't. Ooh, we this time. Back. They came out of nowhere. We need. Oh, he died. Hey, who's the cameraman in all this though? He, he doing real good with the cinematography right now. Oh shit, he died. Is that a hand? Cuts out after that. No calm traffic at all. Just goes dead. There's nothing. Reverse and hold the thirty. Yeah, just like they are. They're dead. Did his shit just move? Like his little status reports. Seventeen minutes out, Captain. No other Alliance ships in the area. Take That's definitely a hand, right? Great. This mission just got a lot more complicated. A small strike team can move quickly without drawing attention. It's our best chance to secure the beacon. All right, grab guess your we're gear on it. and meet us in the cargo hold. Tell Alenko and Jenkins to suit up, Commander. You're going in. All right, bet. I don't know who those two are, but we're gonna do it. Engaging stealth systems. Somebody was doing some serious digging here, Captain. Your team's the muscle in this operation, Commander. Are we to Go in heavy and head straight for the dig site. All right, you what got about it. survivors, Captain? Helping survivors is a secondary objective. The beacon's your top priority. Approaching drop point one. All right, so basically, fuck the news, right? You coming with us? I move faster on my own. Why do you sound different right now? Nihilus will scout out ahead. He'll feed you status reports throughout the mission. Otherwise, I want radio silence. Can we? I'm not gonna question the orders. Understood. Ready and able, sir. The mission's yours now, Shepard. Good luck. All right, let's do we it are then. Approaching drop point two. All the so, I don't know if I trust him though. I don't know how I feel about him right now. Oh, fuck. Okay. Are those the things from Halo? Use to draw your weapon. Fire. Sustained fires cause what? Okay, overheating. Cool, cool. Is this a sniper? I fucking missed. Yeah, these. Okay, they certainly don't blow up like them. But this looks like the. They look like the motherfuckers from Halo. The uh, the flood. Let me switch weapons. Yeah, like that. Oh! I just wasted a fucking grenade. Oh, it's A. Oh, okay. Yeah, hold on. I see some ugly motherfuckers over there to the right. Oh, shit, no. Did he just die? Where'd he go? Buddy died? Bro, what? Can we get him back? Like, can we revive him or some shit? Damn. Hey, that's his fault, though. Or is that my fault? Because I commanded him to go out there. Hey, bro, come here, man. Oh, my God. This motherfucker died? There's a burial we'll at least. He receives a proper service once the mission is complete. But I need you to stay focused. Aye, aye, sir. Damn, I bonded with him. I don't remember his name. Was it Richard? Damn. Yo, that's unfortunate, bro. R.I.P. 
Hey, do these do those things hurt? Like, do they attack us? Do these hurt us? Oh, are these just creatures on the planet, and I just been killing them? They don't even hurt you. Oh, damn. Now nah, I feel bad. Now nah, I feel bad. They just vibing. Okay, let me make sure I don't kill them. You motherfuckers gotta go though. She's still alive. I could have sworn they all died. Well, I guess. Hey, you know how much money they probably spent on that suit? She can't die yet. Is he? Why he look like he getting freaky? Never mind. I was about to say it looked like they was getting freaky with them, the robots, but uh. Maybe they forgot what the safe word was, huh? Man, he got fucked up. Ashley Williams. Alright, was good. Alright. Thanks for your help, Commander. I didn't think I was gonna make it. Honestly, I didn't think you were gonna make it either after what happened to Buddy. Gunnery Chief Ashley Williams of the 212. You the one in charge here, sir? Uh, you alright? Wounded Williams? A few scrapes and burns, nothing serious. The others weren't so lucky. Yeah, I can see that. Oh, man. We were patrolling the perimeter when the attack hit. We tried to get off a distress call, but they cut off our communications. I've been fighting for my life ever since. You been fighting these niggas? Any idea what kind of enemy we're facing? I think they're Geth. Geth? The Geth haven't been seen outside the Vale in nearly 200 years. Why are they here now? What the hell is the Geth? They must have come for the beacon. The dig site is close, just over that rise. It might still be there. Join us, take us there, or stay here. Join us. We could use your help, Williams. Aye, aye, sir. It's time for payback. Uh, what's Geth? What else do you know about the Geth? Just what I remember from history class back in school. They're synthetics, non-organic life forms with limited AI programming, created by the Quarians a few centuries ago. Supposed to be a source of cheap labor, but ended up turning on the Quarians and drove them into exile. That sounds unfortunate. Well, after that, they just kind of disappeared behind the Perseus Veil. Nobody's really heard much from them since. Hmm. What happened before the attack? Describe what happened leading up to the attack. We were sent out a couple of nights ago from the main colony to secure the area. Seemed like a routine patrol. Mm -hmm. Until the Geth hit us. We never knew they were coming. The what happened to the researchers at the dig site? I bet they're dead. I don't know. They set up camp near the beacon. The 232 was with them. Maybe their unit fared better than mine. Probably not. So Tell me beacon. everything you know about the beacon. They were doing some digging out here to extend the monorail and expand the colony. A few weeks ago, they unearthed some Prothean ruins. And mm -hmm. the beacon. Suddenly, every scientific expert in the colony was interested. That's when they brought us in to secure the site. I don't know much about the beacon itself, but I heard one of the researchers say this could be the biggest scientific discovery of the century. You think so? So what about Nihilus then? Have you seen a Turian Spectre around here? There aren't any Turians on Eden Prime. None that I've ever met. Not sure I'd be able to tell if one was a Spectre anyway. If you saw mm. this guy, you'd know. He carries enough firepower to wipe out a whole platoon. Luckily, he's on our side. Let's hope Sorry. so. Like I said, no Turians. All right, let's go. Move out. All right. Can I get damaged by this? Oh, shit, you can. Okay. I'm about to start running, guy. Let me get in the motherfucking face. Boom! Oh, wait, oh, oh, my God, I'm weak. What the fuck? Am I about to die? How do I heal again? Okay. Oh, you can, okay, you can melee. Bitch. Wow. Okay, I didn't realize how quick I die. This is the dig site. The beacon was right here. It must have been moved. By who? Our side or the Geth? Hard to say. Maybe we'll know more after we check out the research camp. You think anyone got out of here alive? If they were lucky, maybe hiding up in the camp. It's just Possibly. on the top of this ridge, up the ramps. All right, let's get up there. Looks like they hit the camp hard. It's a good place for an ambush. They be doing this shit a lot. This shit fun to them? 
Oh, that's not even people anymore. So did they like change? Oh god, they're still alive. What did the Geth do to them? Oh hell, wait, do we have to fight these dudes? Alright, guess let's put them out of their misery. How do zombies have shield? What the fuck? Okay. Not now, Commander. What do you mean not now, Commander? Bitch, didn't I say Shit. If I wanna talk, we gonna talk. The fuck? Oh, are these are scientists? Humans. Thank the maker. What the hell is the maker? Close the door. That's supposed to be before they come back. Whoa, I'm about to shoot him. He look he look like the dudes we just shot outside. You're safe. Don't worry. We'll protect you. Thank you. I think we'll be okay now. It looks like everyone's gone. You're Dr. Warren, the one in charge of the excavation. Mm -hmm. Do you know what happened to the beacon? It was moved to the spaceport this morning. Manuel and I stayed behind to help pack up the camp. When the attack came, the Marines held them off long enough for us to hide. They gave their lives to save us. No one is saved. The age of humanity is ended. Soon, only ruin and corpses will remain. He bugging. He bug he needs some help. Can you tell me anything about the beacon? It's some type of data module from a galaxy-wide communications network. Remarkably well preserved. It could be the greatest scientific discovery of our lifetime. Why she miraculous new technologies, um, groundbreaking medical advances. Who knows what secrets are locked inside? No one does because they're secrets. But um Awaken the beast. Unleashed the darkness. Manuel, please. This isn't the time. Yeah, for real. I'm I'm gonna need him to stay quiet. He freaking me out. She looked like uh what's her face in Detroit? Detroit uh becoming What human? else can you tell me about the attack? It all happened so fast. One second we were gathering up our equipment. The next we were hiding in the shed while the Geth swarmed over the camp. Agents of the destroyers, bringers of darkness, heralds of our extinction. We could hear the battle outside. Or he's Gunfire, it. screams. I thought it would never end. Then everything went quiet. We just sat there, too afraid to move, until you came along. Mm hmm. Assistant? What's wrong with your assistant? Yeah, what's good with him, bro? Manuel has a brilliant mind, but he's always been a bit unstable. Genius and madness are two sides of the same coin. Does she just call him like? So future? he literally is losing the it. Destruction rushing towards us. To understand, there is no escape, no hope. No, I am not mad. I'm the only sane one left. I gave him an extra dose that. of his meds after the attack. Extra dose. I can. Ooh, <laughs> let me calm down. I'm not gonna say that. I want to. But I'm not going to. Um, you see Nihilus? Did you notice a Turian in the area? I saw him, the prophet, leader of the enemy. He was here before the attack. That's impossible. Nihilus was with us in the Normandy before the attack. He couldn't have been here. I I'm sorry. Manuel's still a bit unsettled. We haven't seen your Turian. We've been hiding in here since the attack. Although... He might, I don't know, Williams even though he's crazy, he might be awesome. You can't stop he might be, you know, Nobody he might be ahead of the game. It. Night is falling, the darkness of eternity. Hush, Manuel, go lie down. You'll feel better once the medication kicks in. She got that motherfucker high. All right, well, we're out of here. Move, what the fuck? Oh, there you go. Saren. Saren? You know someone? Oh, them motherfuckers. They look exactly the same. What the fuck? This isn't your mission, Saren. What are you doing here? The council thought you could use some help on this one. The fuck? I wasn't expecting to find the Geth here. The situation's bad. Don't worry. I've got it under control. Oh shit. Did he just die? Did he shoot this nigga? What is that? Off in the distance. Look at the size of it. Did they shoot him, bro? Oh damn. I think they shot Buddy. Alright, let's get down. Bro, I think that's him. Did he really die? Not that fast, right? Are those explosives? Oh! Commander. It's 
Move, bitch. Let me get that metal quick hit, though. Damn, dog, he's dead Someone's already. Moving. Over behind those crates. Wait, don't, don't shoot. I'm one of you. I'm human. Who are you? What are you doing, sneaking around back there? I am sorry. I was hiding from those creatures. My name's Pal. I saw what happened to that Turian. The other one shot him. Other one? What the hell are you talking about? There were two Turians here. Your friend and another one he called Saren. I think they knew each other. Your friend seemed to relax. He let his guard down. And Saren killed him. Shot him right in the back. I'm just lucky he didn't see me behind the crates. Damn. The fuck? Where'd Saren go after I he thought he was runs? cool. He jumped on the cargo Even though I didn't trust him. to the other platform. Probably going after the beacon. I knew that beacon was trouble. Everything's gone to hell since we found it. First that damn mothership showed up, then the attack. They killed everyone. Everyone. If I had been behind the crates, I'd be dead too. I'm surprised they didn't find you. Um. Yeah, they were just like scoping around or whatever with this dude. Like after they shot him. So I'm surprised they didn't find him. Uh, what's Is there anything else you can tell me about the beacon? They brought it here this morning. We loaded it up onto the train and shipped it to the other platform. Hard to believe that was only a few hours ago. Feels like a whole other life. Tell me about this mothership you saw. Yeah, what's up with the ship? I've never seen anything like it before. It, it was huge. The shit that looked like a hand? Landed or a spider or whatever? Platform. The whole place got dark as it came down. And it was making this noise, this, this sound that bored right into your brain. That's what woke me up. The attack came a few minutes later. Woke you up? You were sleeping? I thought you were working here on the docks. I... Sometimes I need a nap to get through my shift. I... I sneak off behind the crates to grab 40 winks where the supervisor can't find me. You survived because you're lazy? Damn. That's wild. But... Hey, he catching some Z's though. I guess you got lucky. If you snuck off for that nap, you'd probably, probably be just dead be, just exactly. like all the others. Yeah. Probably just be done. So at least he's yeah, taking a nap. I don't really want to think about it. That's all right, bro. I'm gonna let you sulk in that. We, we need to, to find go. that beacon before it's too late. Take the cargo train. That's where the other Turian went. I, I, I can't stay here. I need to get away from all this. Damn. What's up with that music? The fuck is? Are there enemies here? Why is it bumping like that? Oh shit! Oh shit! What the fuck? These motherfuckers are on sight! Oh my goodness. Bitch. Me. Yeah. Me. What the fuck is that? Oh my god. Okay, I guess it's not working. Oh, this is the train. Oh, uh, okay, okay. Alright, let's get moving then. We're probably gonna stop here, though. Set the charges. Destroy the entire colony. Leave no evidence that we were here. Damn, even though you left Nihilus' body? Well, I guess he's about to blow everything up, so. What's that music? This motherfucker flying? Ah, oh, shit. Alright everybody, that is Mass Effect for today. Uh, if you like what you see, please give a like, maybe subscribe if you want to. Uh, I'm going to try to stick to about maybe once a week, you know, per video, uh, or 
one video per week. Whatever, you know what I mean. Anyway, we'll catch y'all later. Peace out.